I mean, this is really a he said, she said on the ski slopes. Both are alleging that they ran into one another. And the jury has to decide which one's telling the truth. Camille Vasquez is weighing in on Gwyneth Paltrow's 2016 ski crash trial. Paltrow is being sued by now retired optometrist Terry Sanderson, who claims she crashed into him while skiing and is reportedly seeking more than $300,000 in damages from the actress. The Oscar winner denies all allegations and is countersuing Sanderson, alleging he ran into her and she is asking the jury to award her $1 in symbolic damages and have her attorney's fees covered. Vasquez, who serves as Access Hollywood's legal contributor, explained how she thinks Paltrow is making a point with her countersuit. It's making a statement, right? I mean, when you request nominal damages, you are making a statement that though this incident occurred the way that you claim it, it, it occurred, you're not seeking damages because there were no damages. On Friday, which was the fourth day of the trial, Paltrow was asked if her request for $1 in damages is related to her friendship with Taylor Swift. Swift sued former DJ David Mueller for battery and sexual assault and sought a symbolic $1 in damages back in 2017. Paltrow stated in court that she had not been aware of the singer's suit and the pair were not, quote, good friends. Our legal expert went on to share why she believes Paltrow just didn't settle the case outside of court. Clearly, they were at a standstill and could not settle the case. So I think that each side has dug in, has decided that their version is what actually occurred. And so they're going to let a jury decide. But Vasquez also noted that Paltrow may be trying to send a larger message by, quote, being there and fighting this. I think the celebrity factor really is going to come into as a factor in this case, other than the fact that she obviously is wealthy and could afford to settle this matter and the fact that she hasn't, she's making a point. She's making a statement by being there and fighting this. Vasquez also shared that she believes the Heath mogul will appear in court until the end of trial. It tells me that she's making a statement. She's telling that jury and she's telling the world that's watching, I didn't do this. I'm not responsible for this. I don't believe that he was injured and I'm going to prove it.